If you're using high level and you have an existing WordPress site, this video is going to be really helpful for you because I'm going to be showing you how you can take an existing WordPress site and import it into high level using the high level migration tools. There's lots of options for you in order to migrate your WordPress site into high level. So I'm going to walk you through each one of them today in this simple, quick video. So again, if you are using WordPress, it's going to be super valuable for you. My name is Andrew. Let's dive right in. Now within your sub account, whenever you navigate to sites, you will see the WordPress tab here. If you're not already subscribed to the WordPress feature, make sure you subscribe so that way you can get access to all of the WordPress features within high level. Then you're going to have a demo site, right? You can build this from a template or you can just have a blank site whenever you go to create a new site. But whenever you get your first website in here, this will be your kind of area to manage this site. And on this first screen, whenever we scroll down, we will be able to see this section for importing our existing website. Now we have three different options. We have a lead connector plugin, which we can download here. We have manual migration, which allows us to simply upload a .wpress file in order to manually import the site here. Or you can request help if you are struggling with either of these options through the White Glove Migration Assistance. Today we're gonna to be talking about mostly this effortless migration with our plugin. We can simply click download here, and then this is going to download a zip file to our desktop. And don't worry, this is still super simple. If you need help being guided along using this process, go to the migration guide right here on this screen. If you click this, this will open up the step-by-step -step migration guide, walking you through how to go through all of these steps. So after this video, you can walk through this as you're doing this yourself, if you have any questions. Now back here, as you remember, we just downloaded our plugin. And what we're going to do is we're going to log in to our WordPress admin portal, and then we're going to go to plugins. And what we're going to do is we're going to add a plugin. And when we go to this screen, we can then click upload plugin. This is where we're going to select that file that we just downloaded. So select that lead connector plugin after you click upload plugin and then click choose file. Now, once you've picked up that plugin from your desktop, you can then click install now in your WordPress admin manager. Once you wait a couple seconds, it will then say it is installing the plugin and all you have to do is click activate plugin within your WordPress account. Then you'll see the plugin has been activated and we're good to go. You'll be able to see in your plugins list, this is the lead connector WP migrator. That is the plugin that we are going to be using here. Now, once this has been installed, you'll see on the left-hand side, LC migrator. We're going to click that and then we will see this portal where we can click sign into our account. This is going to navigate us over to this high level screen. If you're familiar with this, you've seen this before here, you can click log in and then log into your agency. Just use the same login details that you use for your existing high level agency and click sign in. And then once you are logged into your agency, it might reroute you back to this tab or you'll have to go back to the marketplace tab. Uh, this is essentially the tab where we can confirm that we are installing this app. We can just click next. Then it will prompt you to select a sub account. And as soon as you select your sub account, it will then say you are now successfully connected with the lead connector migration plugin. You can then click continue. Then you'll be navigated to this screen where you can select your WordPress site that you want to migrate into high level. Then you can select your website here. Here is our demo marketing agency website. We can acknowledge that this will be overwritten and then click start migration. Now this is by far the easiest process that you can use in order to get a WordPress site into high level. The other options take a little bit more effort using some third party plugins, but now high level has their own white labeled plugin using the lead connector plugin in order to migrate WordPress sites over. So you can use this for yourself and you can also use it for your customers because as you can see here, we're already at 86%. It's only been about 30 seconds and we are already just about done with this migration. And it's really simple for your customers to get their sites into high level. So I'll check back in with you when this is done. And I'll see you in a second. Okay. And just like that, our migration has been completed. You'll see this screen whenever your migration is done. And then back in our high level, we'll be able to see that site. There's our demo marketing agency. We can preview the site here and our WordPress site is now connected to high level, which means we can use things like chat widgets, forms, payment systems, everything that we love about high level, we can now use with a WordPress website. So this is awesome. It makes the process really simple. Again, if you have questions, just check out that migration guide and follow the steps. It's just really simple to use in order to get your WordPress site into high level. As always, I hope you found this helpful. My name is Andrew and thank you very much for watching.